finally leave my gas tank. What is up? Let me adjust this little camera here. Another day in the dollar, baby. Another dollar day. Well, I don't know why people say that. Um, beautiful day down here in SoCal. Just kind of uh, going through some product reviews. Taking the time to enjoy the beach. I love the ocean. I got to get in the ocean every day. I'm just cruising down here on Pacific Coast Highway. Heading north. Just uh, wrapping up one of uh, a solar generator videos, so I got a couple of things I got to do while I'm here. I had the uh, oil changed. I checked the brakes, check make sure everything was uh, copacetic. I got to take out the spare tire in the back of the, the rig. I'm putting, trying to put in a uh, bicycle rack. I don't like adding any more length on the back of this uh, rig because I like being able to pull into parking spots at uh, parking lots like Walmart, those kind of things where I don't have to worry about finding two spaces. So I'm going to remove the tire in the back and there's, a, there's like a uh, receiving hitch that I can bolt on to the back of the bumper because this RV, is no, you're not, it's some reason nobody can put uh, a receiving hitch in the back of the uh, the RV itself because of the way it was uh, the frame was built and so I have to I had went online looking for something that can replace that and I found something I'll go ahead and show you guys later I'm gonna go ahead and pull up and looking for a spot on the uh, on the ocean side over here in uh, Dana Point to uh, pull over Take care of a couple things. Finish one of the videos that I'm doing. Product review. I got a really cool uh, solar generator that I'm I'm reviewing right now. And then I'm gonna go ahead and try and put on that uh, bicycle. That I mean that bicycle on the uh, receiving hitch in the back of the bumper. So I'll sh I'll take you guys on. Show you guys what I'm talking about. Uh, I got a couple other things. I got a little fix lead. That. We all know when you're in an RV. Um, you gotta be, a, you gotta take care of business. You can't just let things sit; otherwise, they start adding up. So when you got a, when you got something that needs to be repaired, just get it done, get it fixed, because things start to add up. People always uh, give me uh, crap. They go, "Oh, you're in a '94." Whoa, you know, not making fun of, but you know, but it's a, the things in great condition when it comes to maintenance. You know. My engine's great. Been back to forth New York three times in this thing. Been to Oregon, Washington, all the states, Iowa, Idaho, and I'm planning on making another trip up here up north when uh, winter, you know, when things start uh, dissipating a little bit up north when it comes to the white stuff. So, I mean, uh, yeah, down here on Pacific Coast Highway, we're up. The beach is called Capo Beach. If you ever come down here, it's a great place for day use for RVs. You got to get down here. It's right next to Doheny California, uh, State Park. Doheny, California State Park, Doheny, I think it's called. And it's a little south of that. It's right along the ocean. You pull an RV up right on the water. It's really a great uh, location. It's directly in the middle of between Los Angeles and San Diego, right by Doheny State Park. Easy to find. Uh, you got to check it out. A lot of you know a lot of things around here to do. You got the Dana Point Marina. You got San Clemente Pier Bowl down south. There's a beautiful uh, uh, trail. Uh, they call it the uh, oh god, what do they call it? But it's a trail between Dana Point and all the way down south to San Clemente State Beach, not Doheny, but San Clemente State Beach. I did a video on that. You guys can check it out. But uh, it's about a uh, six mile trail you can walk it you can ride it on your bicycle no e-bikes though and you just beautiful walk there and back from here all the way from dana point all the way down there to the end of san clemente right to, right to the tip of the camp pendleton marine base a lot of things to do around here so uh 
I'm gonna pull over here at the uh, Capo Beach. Gonna uh, take care of some Bizwick, make some lunch, and then I'll update you guys. campground on the right going to the state park. down that way you park for its day use area guys I'm telling you from 6 a.m. to 10 p.m. you can spend all day park at your motorhome right on the beach as long as you're not over 25 feet you got a bunch of stores restaurants down there you got Dana Point stores. Marina right there or you just get on your e-bike like I do and enjoy the ride it's about a uh, five mile trip from the pier in San Clemente, all the way down there to the tip of Dana Point, which is the marina. bow thanks for watching subscribing liking please comment let me know what you think about the videos and also check out some of my product reviews i appreciate it and hope you guys have a great day see you next time